two people are dead after authorities in Florida say a gyrocopter crashed into a mobile home park. The Highland County Sheriff's Office says it happened in Sebring. The two who died were on board the copter. A person on the ground was also injured and taken to a local hospital. According to reports, the aircraft was from local company Gyroplane Guy. They say it was being flown by the company's owner, 45-year-old Christopher Lord, who also had a 52-year-old passenger with him. Firefighters rushed to put out the flames at the Sebring Falls Mobile Home Park. Local reports say one home was completely destroyed by the crash, while others caught on fire. But authorities say they were all unoccupied. The Federal Aviation Administration will investigate the crash. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Mara Matsulbano.